So, shall we finish chapter five and then call for a night? Because I really need to move on at some point. Um, this has been really good fun though. I'm enjoying the fuck out of this game. Right, let's go back to Plaza 99 and move on to the next one. So I got my ass beat by a um, mare, mare, you know them thingy. Um, didn't like that. Didn't like getting my ass beat at all, by any stretch of imagination. And um, I feel like I've missed out on a really great opportunity by missing out on the EXP from that fight. But I think I may do it again very soon whenever I get a little bit more of a boost. But um, it's just the fact that I spent so much money on these healing items. Back up to 10. Boom, sorted. Yeah, I don't like the, these Phoenix Downs are pretty goddamn useless because if you get knocked down with that little amount of health left, you're not getting back up again and surviving the next onslaught of attacks. It's really, really shitty. Right, I think that's everything I need. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. So that's all the rooms. I was wondering what all the locked up like question marks was. That's all the locations now unlocked in this um, place now in the town in Nine Acre Woods. <laughs> isn't, that, isn't that the name of the woods that um, I'm trying to remember? Winnie the Pooh is from. Right. Where were we? Dungeons, Pyroglow Flower Forest. Let's try that again. Well, at least we can move quite easily through this hole. Right, let's do this. Here we go! Fire time. Burn, boom, bang! Hey. Double smash, bitch! Predictable. Double smash. It's effective. On rocking and rolling. Come on. Right. These are making progress. I'm just gonna skip past this motherfucker this time. Actually, here's a question: Did I get to keep that motherfucker? I'm saying motherfucker. <laughs> I say over and over again. I meant the shark that I caught it the last time. I right, put in our. <gasps> oh! He's there. Look. Oh, that's kind of cool. So, uh, yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna be using Sephiroth. <laughs> Why the hell wouldn't I? Oh. Oh, right. So I was wondering there because they actually considered them as mini adventures. Right, so I was just looking there because it seemed to be filled in for a reason. Uh, yeah, we need to get into fight. We need to start beating the crap out of things because I really want to go and use Sephiroth now, like in the next fight. So, um, uh, context, let's see if we got anything breeding out of context for this. Um, let's make ourselves a little bit stronger. Uh, what have we got? What have we got? Accuracy. Oh, God, we really need some goddamn accuracy. Yeah, so accuracy's going up. 
we have two left, which is completely worthless to all of these. Eh, whatever. Copper gnome. Not that interesting. So, uh, what do we got? What do we got? We've got three, three, two, two, three, two, 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 three. Um, spank hand. Completely forgot about spank hand. We should probably check in on spank hand. <laughs> Twice? Oh, cool. Non-lethal? Awesome! That is going to be really useful. So, um, one, two, two, four, six, eight, two, three, three, four, five, six, seven, okay, so... Two, four, six, eight. I can actually get across there. So let's try. Ooh, prevents enemies from escaping as well. So let's see. We go right claw, cat claw. Oh, can knock people to sleep? Yes, that is going to be damn useful. I'm going to put something in that blank space. Um, thunder, cure, thunder, cure, thunder, cure, thunder. Thunder! And subdue! Bam! That's awesome! Right, so I'm liking this dude. Um, right, Claw, so I'm pretty sure I'm going to be switching him in as the large for one of my characters. Um, let's see what way we're going to work that stack up. Uh, stack... Who doesn't have enough... Well, who's doing physical, anyway? She's doing physical. So we'll go with her on this stack. We'll do this. Spike hand. And then we go for a small. That is probably going to be pidgey just for the amount of money that we can get. Although, Mog might actually have his enough for his abilities now. Hmm. Right, let's do that. Let's see if Mog's got enough now. Enough at least to actually heal. Because then we can actually cover healing and three, five, three, six. Yep, so we can cover for that anyway. Agility up and restore HP. And with next four, we get another heal. Bam, sorted. Happy days. That's what I want. It's what I want. Yeah, that's what I want. Boom, happy days. Right, so, um, that means you. Oh, no. There we go. Yay! Oh, fuck right off, you prick. A little medley with the champions now, charge. Come on, break Probably let's do. Oh, begin. Look at this twin headed dragon. This is adorable. Dual lizard. I'm trying to think of actually. Whoa, what's throw? Oh, right. Very nice. So, Thunder. Mm. See, whenever she's large, she can do the Thunder Strike, but um, let's cast Thunder on Mogul. Okay. Let that Mogul out. Boom. Down you go. Down goes the Moogles! Moogle drop! Ah, oh, I kinda wish I'd actually used that one because it was a critical. Yeah. 
Jesus! That's a lot of criticals I'm getting on that one. So what do we need for this dual lizard? Reduce the run. Okay. So, uh, abilities. Jeez, HP. Fine. Oh crap! Well, that was close. Oh wow! You are really close to dying. And that's you captured. Boom! Jewel lizard. I'm assuming the jewel lizard turns into a proper badass hydra whenever it goes giant. But uh, still, then. It's just so a bad. cute little dragon. One body, twice the lizard. Rap battles itself regularly, but always loses. It's because it spits so much poison on the mic, it melts. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Well, yeah, fair play. So lots of kind of attacks. Dual lizard, water, double attack, poison bite, strength, 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 water converter, like space, thunder, acid fang, triple attack. So it has three heads on the level of one. Thunderbolt, jet fire, acid mist. Ooh, sounds pretty badass. Um, give me a mirage. Iganook. <laughs> Iganog. Even better. Arr! Yeah, who's getting dropped for that? I do believe it may be the person who I have not used in any way, shape, or form. You! Well, admittedly, I don't really need the Blizzard motherfucker at the moment. I don't like him. He's got the higher HP, really, actually. 2626222523. Don't need you. Go away. See, it's adorable to have one that's actually giant size, one that's tiny. It's only because of actually the fact that I want to have this battle configuration. Otherwise, huh? I would keep them at full size. What's that light? Yeah. Oh, awesome! I know that light. This is my story. I'm gonna tell my tale, it'll be my story. Nah, it wasn't your story, dude. It was the story of somebody else that you were taking part in. Kinda sucks to only have been a character in somebody else's story, hasn't it? I'm willing to bet a good portion you have no goddamn idea what I'm talking about. <laughs> you got it now? Yeah, you should. Right, let's see what we got. Um, I want to hit everybody. Why do I not have anything that hits everybody? Right, abilities, abilities, abilities. All right, let's let's kill some things. Um, let's kill the moogle. No, let's kill the. Ooh, look, that's twice. Let's go with the cup trees. Boom! Not enough to kill that damn thing? Really? Oh, God. Are you serious? Looks like I've 
So I thought I was actually getting a really cool character really early on by getting the Moogle in that combat thing, but no, no, what the? What is this? Oh. oh, thank you for the wobble stopper. You're a good guy, you little choco. Okay. So I'm, the little Firefly Sparkles thing, if you haven't figured it out yet, it's from another Final Fantasy game. Yeah, obviously. I kind of don't want to say it just, I want to say it just before we get to the bit. Oh, what the hell? I was wondering there, I thought one was like floating between his heads. Uh, let's throw something at that stack. <laughs> That's awesome. Immediately worked. Boom, straight down they go. Down you go. That was a good fight. Oh, hey. Problem solved. Do you know what the problem was? They were still alive, so I fixed it by making them dead. Hmm. Oh, for God's sake. I'm gonna get into another fight! Oh, this is actually a thing, at least I can check. I'm glad the map shows the whole map if I wanted to check it so I can go and like, ah, there's something over there, but uh, it doesn't work like that. Whoa! Four of these motherfuckers? Alright, fine. Bring it on! Better to take out. See, it feels like such a waste to attack with just one move like that, but take one out at a time is good enough. Forest Nocturne. That was useful. Looks like I'm Tom Pom Pom Koopa. And occasionally it actually gives me more than one heal. That's super useful as a heal attack. Damn useful. That's actually going to be useful to have. Although, admittedly, most games, if I get poisoned or I get hit by like something like that, I try to force the match or the fight to finish as quickly as possible because if you end up sitting there, like, you have to pass heals, pass heals, pass heals, you keep getting infected over and over again. There's no, like, kind of, like, preventative My nature. legs are about to fall off. No, stop your complaining, kiddo. 
So that's the sieve. That's where we need to go. So I'm gonna go left, and then I'm gonna go metal, and then I'm gonna go Talking right. Talking about it only makes it worse. But you do have a point. I guess this is wearing me down. Oh, wouldn't it be great if the mirages in our stacks could just carry us around? Ha! <laughs> Oh, come on. It's not that simple. Actually, yeah, it is. We can? Do yes! <laughs> it's just an extra wee thing just to make it visually interesting to ride around, but... Let's make this good. Dude, it's on. Any more attack all moves? Come on! Don't like it in the dark. Boom, done and dusted. Victory! Yeah, just grinding along, singing a song, side by side. Would you like to sing on a star, Every moonbeams home in a jar? Are you better off than you were, or would you rather be a pig? A pig is an animal with dirt on his face. Okay, here we go. I won't the hold man back. The manners are a terrible disgrace. Okay, so abilities. Throw. <laughs> so, well, guess what's gonna happen? Again. All right, juice HP. Okay. So you just need to attack. Continues to grow. We just don't know where it comes from. Just the fact that the enemies carry around that much money with them. They did point it out in like one of the previous bits. It's like it's just the will of the gods. Wait, what? What the fuck? 
All right, I wasn't. Ca I was hoping it wasn't going to get all elaborate in the forest and make me go a bunch of different directions. But uh, let's take the quest to see what's in here. Oh no, no, no! We'll come back here. We'll come back some other time. But no. This is all flowing in one particular direction. You notice that? Hmm. Yeah. I'm following the spirits. The spirits guide me. They lead me. They tell me where I must go. What the hell? What the heck is that? Um, not what I was expecting, but uh, let's just uh, fix this up right here. Uh, you know, just grab a little potion and uh, and just uh, make it a little bit easier for me to go in and kick its ass, whatever the hell it is. Okay. <laughs> Odd mechanical man. I'll get us through this. Uh, this looks like bad news. Okay. Magic jar? Oh, this does not bode well. Fourteen mm. hundred. We get Stark. Yes. An elixir? Okay. Um, do I have any elixirs? Do you know what I'm gonna do? I am just going to, uh, you know, uh, defend on that one. See how much damage I can do with the dark. If I take him down, I'll take him down for the XP. There's only no way I can prism him. Wow. Yeah, we just need to use this. <laughs> That's your only option. Ah. You can't take me down. You know why? Because I keep defending. Oh, almost down. Um, I'll have him out of the way in a second. That all you got? Yeah, he's Good down. Luck. Why won't you die? Overkill. Come on. Watch this. Done. And bye bye. Looks like I talked that about wasn't so bad. Cool. Nice big boost of EXP. It was worth it. I hope these guys are not like one shot chances, you know? Very unlikely that it would be. Mementos. So, I came and followed this all the way here for no real apparent reason because there's 
nothing here. Really? So no, the problem is now I need to backtrack and find my way home. Okay. Alright, so it's a maze that there was only one particular way out of. I get ya. That's what I'm curious about. Does it take me anywhere else? Eh, great. Take me back to where I needed to be. <laughs> I'm only noticing the little squeaky step from the chocobo now, which is cute and adorable and all, but uh, yeah. I won't hold back. Right, let's do this. Let's go for it, man. Take this. Oh, that was a bad mess. Their defense is that high, I need to actually find some way to knock them down, so throw is the only option. I have to build up six again. So, till then, just attack, attack, attack. Block fire. This is it. Oh, resist. I didn't notice didn't pay attention the first time. Bam! Miss. Oh yeah! Wow! Like <laughs> yeah, so dark works. save point so obviously we're about to run into something uh, we're about to run into something that's probably going to be the boss for this chapter I have a feeling I know what it is and I pray to Yevon that it doesn't uh, go horribly wrong for me is there any more clues I can drop about where I think this is going with the next motion or the next event the next next story next person next link that we're going to have have we not figured it out yet you will you will yay yuna <laughs> so we're probably going to end up unlocking titus in the very near future Oh man, I remember how beautiful this looked in Final Fantasy X whenever they did it the first time. The, um, the summonings, the, um, the sp water sprite spirals and the, the dust light. And I was going like, oh man, this is what Final Fantasy needs to look like forever. I was like, no, not really. Ten's not a game in the series that I massively enjoy. I really have issues with it, but it's not the worst. It just... A lot of the characters didn't feel really comfortable with what? each other. Really? They didn't, and I'm willing to bet there was a lot of awkwardness involved. I think, I think it was just, it, it was an intention to well before. to be awkward, but it wasn't written well to express <sighs> that very well. I can't.
can't remember. Oh. Traveling with a mirage? It seems clear the two of you are not from Grimoire. She's going to make a costume change. She's going to do a costume change. She's going to turn into yeah, the gunsmith. We kind of forgot to shrink down too. I thought it was song stress. I don't know. You know, that's stuff. Can't do references, folks. You? Maybe lost on a lot of people. She's a very star-faced you know? Have more of you been sent to plague us? Your kind have brought enough chaos into this world already. Right. She's not a happy bunny. Hey there, Balafor! You look adorable! Be gone now, Queen Grimoire! You have no place here! No, I think I, I just think I do have a place here. I'm gonna take that off you. Maybe we should get the going while the getting's still good! I don't understand it. Why is she so mad at us? Yeah, Vaughn! What did you do to her anyway? Oh, what did, what you did you I do? do? Why is it my fault? Okay, so. Yet. I'm sure Valifor is the one that we worry about damage-wise. Um, yep, he takes damage from ice. Oh, Christ. This is whenever I could have done with the ice. Um, crap. Oh, lightning. Ow, per girl. One of the things where I just feel like I'm trying to get this fight as over with as fast as possible, but it's just a matter of the fact I've found a pattern that works to attack these guys down if I can get them to break their goddamn shield in some way, shape, or form. There we go. Get them to fall down again. Still don't have enough. Why am I not recovering any um, AP? A particular reason why I'm not getting AP. Whoa! Holy shit! Take this, 
I should have thought about that before I whenever I saw the um, power up thing. Fall over. Oh, crap. Um Defend. Defend. Yeah, we survived that one. That didn't do enough. Boom. Okay, good. Fall down, Yuna. Fall down! Oh, God. Done and done. go. Valifor Memento. So I'm assuming these mementos are any ones that I the get one chance at to give me a memento and then I can use mementos much later on to then get them at Tell a later me. point. I'm assuming I'll find an area you? that I can unlock huh? it from. You said? Miss <gasps> Farna? But that's our mother. Uh, hey, you're right. So there's nothing to remember yet at least. It's uh, a good sign. Listen. You wouldn't happen to know this, Luce Farna. Let me show you something. <laughs> this is a, sometimes these characters are absolutely just adorable. Like, let me show you something. Can we just carry you because, you know, it'll be faster? <gasps> right, so who's this? That's the earring. The same one Mom used to wear. All right. Then it's her? That's Luce Farna. I I recognized it. The ornament on Yuna's staff. Oh, wow. Roughly 100 years ago, a champion from another world saved Grimoire. Her dun. name was Luce Farna. Huh? Mom did that? But a hundred years... Love the remixes of the music in this. It makes sense. Mom's a champion? And this is some kind of monument to her? Hmm. So, you keep saying that Lady Luce was your mother. Again, may I ask who you are? Well, uh... Explanation, explanation, explanation. <laughs> it's like, ah! no, I'm dropping down. That is strange. So essentially, like, uh, we put a cut in here because we didn't want to bother putting a long bit of dialogue in. We'd appreciate anything at all. I'm sorry. I only know the common legends. The ones Grimoire's people have grown up with. Yeah, but how Fine. true are the legends? We'll That's the question. Sometime around a century ago, the world of Grimoire was nearly destroyed by a being that has come to be known as the Demon Dyad. 
Lucifarna prevented this by creating the Ultima Gate, a bridge to Ultima Gate, so Ultima Magic involved mm. straight from the realm of the gods. Thus, she became Grimoire's <coughs> champion. That definitely the sounds like heralds? something out of mythology. Bridging the gap between worlds is a serious accomplishment. She must have been the main. So Harold, that she was, but sadly, is that even implying... though she managed to save the world from the demon dyad. Huh? That the girl who the forgot heads, her name. All three of them chose to remain here in Grimoire. All right. And one of them is now Brandalus, king of Bahamut. Right, so they're the heralds. But Bahamut. So Brandalus, um, Skakrim, yes. whatever it was, the guy with the foot head. Saving the world, Brandalus and the others harnessed a legion of new mirages and slowly took control of Grimoire's lands, building a powerful federation. A legion of new mirages, on. You don't think there's any connection to the ones we lost? More than likely. Do you? What? That's not possible. We're talking about a hundred years. Yeah, but you've been asleep for a hundred years, quite possibly. But where have we been? Remember where you were. Yeah, Nine Hills, Hills which times Crow different. Told us was a world without time. Right, Tama? Right, there you are. Compared to other the worlds, the concept of time there is, let's say, more than a little bit the unusual. So, if you want to know just the how long you were there. There's really the no way to measure. Dude, what? Um, Dude, if you don't Sweet. mind my asking, whatever happened to Lady Luce after the heralds came? They locked her in a box. She's sure. living in a box. Some say something. Living in a glass prison box. She's living in a box. While others living in a glass prison box. She's living in a box. Her freedom lost forever. Prisoner? <laughs> what? Well then, where can we find this castle? I wish I could help, but I don't know where to find it. Not just me. No well, that's the whole point. It probably teleports and moves around. Considering the fact that the locations are a little bit weird here. Randalus keeps its whereabouts a secret. Huh? How do you hide a big honking castle? Hey, take it Because it's Hoyle's moving Come castle, on. you fuck. It's a legend. Are you really gonna get all worked up over something carved on a rock? They share the same name. That doesn't automatically have to mean they're the same person. Yes, they are. Well. It generally means it has yeah, to be the same person. In the context of a JRPG, it is obviously is just the same person. Would you listen? All the stuff we're remembering? Like Mom's name? What if it turns out none of it is true? But I guess there's no point in telling Mom that. What, what is it already? She's I'm got a lot it. of internal monologue going on. I like the, the fact that they're the two characters are very, very different, but... She seems to there. be the lead. Seronia lies further north. I believe they just joined the Federation. What? Do what? But I thought Seronia was the place we're going to. Then Princess Sarah must not have known. <sighs> well, mm -hmm. we already made it this far. Yeah. We wouldn't be very good emissaries if we turn back now. And we did promise to ask about the League of S. I'm real sorry I raised my voice at you. I uh, know you were trying to help us out, so thanks. No, I should be sorry for attacking you. It was wrong to accuse you of being something you're clearly not. That's very true. Take that to heart, kids. Don't judge people. Oh, right. To get to Seronia, you will need to pass through a frigid place called Icicle Ridge. Okay. If you have mirages who can use fire magic, you may find your passage considerably easier. Excellent, very much. Thank you for all that info. Um, we have to continue on this way. So, you know, it was nice to meet you. Um, we gotta head on here. So, catch you later. Obviously, you weren't the boss. <laughs> Which is fine. We'll just continue on. I thought we were going to be finishing off Chapter 5 really quickly here, but no, apparently not. Again, it shall be Ragnarok. A battle. Initiated by new champions, and yet, to whose salvation? You're beyond salvation. <laughs> what the hell? Oh shit! An illusion. <laughs> what the well, fuck? Well, no matter. A chase is more to my liking. I tire of simply waiting. Right. Well, fuck you if you're going to attack Yuna. 
Hmm. That was perturbing. So, is that our chapter finished? I imagine it is. With the autosave, I imagine that's actually the end of chapter 5. Ladies and gentlemen, guys, thank you very much for watching. Um, I That plume knight freaks me out a little bit, but I want to know who she is. Um, I've got a feeling that at least one of Anna Kroos... One like some some one of those characters is hiding their identity underneath somebody else's as a herald, pretend to be a god, and somebody. I'm curious to know what happens next. So I really want to get back to this game. But this is the end of our session for tonight. So guys, thank you very much for watching. This has been chapters one through five in this batch of Worlds of Final Fantasy. Worlds of Final Fantasy. Worlds of the Final Fantasy. World of Final Fantasy. Thank you very much for watching. If you want to catch up any more of the episodes, you can go, of course, hit the subscribe button that's sitting up here. Look at it sitting in that wee spot right there. Or you can actually go over here and hit some of the buttons for any episodes that have actually been on in the last well, wee while. It'll be part of this playlist or in other playlists that are available on the channel. I hope you enjoyed yourselves and I hope to see you again very, very soon. So thank you very much for watching and I will see you all in the next episode. Bye-bye.